Hi guys, I am officially going to introduce you to Ava. There she is. She's a little wormy right now, but um she her name is Ava. She's 12 weeks old. She just turned 12 weeks on Monday, and I've had her officially for a week today, and she went to the vet yesterday. Oh, but I'll tell you about that in a little bit. Uh, I got the name Ava because I've actually, it was, um, I, her hair color is red. And I actually wanted to name her something that had to deal with red. And I was thinking of all the famous redheads. And so I was thinking of Ariel or Ginger or like Lucy, something along those lines. And my, my family wanted to name her Cayenne because uh, that's a, you know, that's a spice and it's red. But I was, just wasn't feeling, like, I I was calling her Ariel, but I just did not like calling her that. So I was just, I was looking through a list of 100 most popular dog names, and I came across Ava. And that's actually a name that I would name a daughter if I ever had one. I really like that name, and it's short, so it's really easy to say. And I went with Ava because I really like that name, and so she's... She seems like an Ava, so I, I'm I'm really happy with the name. And so with the vet, we went yesterday, and she she did so well. It was it was really incredible to watch her with at the vet because some dogs just do not like the vet. And she got her temperature taken, which involved putting a thermometer up her butt, but she did not flinch at all. Um, she also got a shot right here, and she did not flinch or bark or anything. The only time she barked was when she got her toenails clipped. They were really long, and I, I was surprised that the vet clipped them, but he did, and she didn't seem to mind except for when she um, yelped just once. And she weighs 8 pounds. Uh, she, she can't officially go to the park until next month when she gets the last of her shots um because you know she could get sick from the other dogs or vice versa and i really wanted to socialize her early but i have to wait until she gets all her shots and that should be fun but um she's she's good for the most part i'm trying to potty train her and it's been really difficult but it's only been a week she's had a lot of accidents in the house and it's like it's it's not that I don't take her out. I take her out all the time. Um, it's when I take her out, she comes back in the house and she still does it. So that's kind of frustrating. But she's eating very well. She goes to the bathroom outside, pee pee and poo poo. Okay, what are you smelling? Okay. Um, what else did I want to mention to you guys? She, <laughs> I've been trait craning, trait, that's not right. I've been crate training her. And she does not like to be in the crate. Crate for the initial tw uh, initial like five to ten minutes, she'll like scream, and it's called the Sheba scream because it's so distinctive. She sounds like she's in a lot of pain, but she's just getting her frustrations out. And she sleeps really. She sleeps pretty good. Last night, because of her shot, she slept for a really long time, like seven hours which was I think the most that she went to sleep like on like without waking up um I have to take her out like every three hours and I'm itching myself because it's funny but I am allergic to her and it's actually all dogs and especially cats I'm allergic to and I'm taking a lot of Benadryl um my eye this eye is a little bit puffy because you can see right here I am just I ha I was itching my eyes, I and that's I should know better. I should wash my hands if I'm gonna go touch my face. But I'm allergic, a little allergic to her, but I'm gonna sacrifice because I love her so much. And even though she is a little bit bad, she's still a puppy and she's learning um, the rules. Um, I still love her. I look at this face and I'm like just melt. Look at this face. So. Yes, yeah, um, she's she's good. She's good, and I'm so happy that I have her. And hopefully, I will update you guys on her. I I might do it monthly. I try to vlog, but it's not very interesting. It's me looking extremely tired and her in her cage howling. So I didn't think that would be too much fun, but I'll update you guys monthly just to let you know how she's doing. And the next time I'll probably update you guys is when we go to her appointment, which is in April. So 
I will end the video now because I have to take her to the bathroom. And yeah, she's, she's, I don't know, she's just a good, she, I could tell she's just a good girl. She just needs a little bit of help. So, um, say goodbye, Ava. It's time for you to go to the bathroom. Say goodbye. <laughs> Bye, guys. I hope you guys are well.